Life Stallions, what's up? Kina Barber here, back with another video, back with another sneaker review. So today's sneaker review is gonna be on the Man Space Mixed Media Trainer Shoe, which is gonna come in this box right here. Now, before we get into this sneaker, you already know what to do, guys. Make sure you smash that subscribe button. Also, get a video a thumbs up if you like the content and follow me on my Instagram page, at Kimi Lifestyle. So without further ado, let's roll that intro. Welcome back to the channel guys. So we are talking about the Man Space Mixed Media Trainer Sneaker Shoe by Dolce & Gabbana, which is gonna come in this box right here. Now this is a shoe that I picked up online from Neiman Marcus. It's a sneaker that I haven't really seen anyone rock or I haven't really seen any reviews on it. But before I give you guys my thoughts and opinion on these sneakers, uh, what we're gonna do is we're gonna head over to my station and we are going to open up this box and check out the sneaker itself and also do an on-foot review. So let's head over to my station. So here's the box the sneakers come in. It's gonna come in this uh, all white box that's gonna be covered in a bunch of graffiti kind of artwork even on the bottom of the box gonna have a bunch of artwork on here you see like a robot there you see the crown very artsy box in the very middle of it you're gonna see the Dolce Gabbana which is gonna be in this kind of a canvas uh, material so let's open up the box and check out the shoes and everything that comes inside So here are the shoes. Let's take off this plastic cover. Okay guys, so here's the Dolce Gabbana space shoes, I call it. Um, actually it's called mixed media. But uh, let's go over some of the details on this shoe. So the Dolce Gabbana sneaker is gonna come in a metallic cap, leather suede, mesh fabric, and rubber. So let's start off with the bottom part of the shoe, it's gonna come in all red, and this whole bottom piece is gonna be in rubber, and it's gonna say Dolce Gabbana in the center piece there. It's gonna have a little Dolce Gabbana right there. You're gonna see these rubber pieces right here, and it's gonna follow from the back heel of the shoe with uh, more of that rubber pieces there. Uh, you're gonna see some of this metallic leather. It's almost like a patent leather, but it's more metallic. Going towards the toe part of the shoe, it's gonna be in suede. And then you're gonna see DG5862. I'm not sure what that stands for. Drop a comment, let me know if you know what that means. This is gonna also be in that rubber material as well. On the toe part of the shoe, you're gonna see that um, red rubber kind of follow all the way up on it. And then you're gonna see little black grips that's gonna be on toe box of the shoe. And then you can also see some of that uh, metallic leather as well, followed by this kind of a 3M reflector uh, around it as well. And then we're gonna have two sets of laces, which is gonna be in red. And then you can also have a black lace as well, which is gonna say Dolce Gabbana on it. And you can also have two lace systems here. It's gonna be an inward lace system and also the outer lacing system. So inner part of the shoe is gonna basically be the same thing. You're gonna see the two rubber um, lace holders there and you're gonna see the uh, metallic leather. It's gonna have that hard mesh material that's gonna follow the shoe as well. On the heel part of the shoe, you're gonna see Dolce Gabbana on it, written in black. And this is gonna be like a soft metallic leather on the heel part of the shoe. And you're gonna see more of that rubber heel. On the tongue of the shoe, it's gonna have that 3M reflector. And then you're gonna have that tag that's gonna say Dolce and Gabbana, which is gonna be in a canvas material. And then the Dolce Gabbana is gonna have that rubber material on there as well. Let's see here. So inside the shoe, you're gonna see the Dolce Gabbana. It's gonna come in this, I wanna say, I'm not sure what this fabric is inside of the shoe, but it's very soft. It's all black. And so looking at this shoe, it looks very futuristic, I would say. The colors on here, obviously it's gonna be red, black, and 
kind of gray, and then you're also gonna have that metallic color as well. Uh, the color scheme of the shoes is a very easy shoe to wear, although the size of the shoe is very chunky, so it's more of a chunky shoe. And if you guys know me and been following me, you know that I'm a fan of chunky shoe, that chunky kind of dad shoe, very wide. Kind of also reminds me of the Balenciagas as far as the chunkiness of this shoe. Definitely has a, a Balenciaga vibe to it. Also, it is a bit of a heavy shoe as well. Usually when you have chunky shoes, they usually are heavy. I really like this little piece on the back heel part of the shoe. I think that's really dope. And then the other shoe is pretty much the same thing. Same details. Yeah, they're both together. So that was the open box and also on foot review of these sneakers right here. So pricing of these sneakers is going to run you about $1,095 for these sneakers. When it comes to sizing of these sneakers, I would say go true to size. I'm a size 13 and these shoes fit me pretty good. So when it comes to design of this shoe, it is an Italian made shoe and my favorite part I would say is the back part of the shoe on the heel of it. I just really like how this heel sticks out with this rubber piece here and just the way it looks in the back. It just really stands out, especially when you're walking in this shoe. And then when you have that 3M reflector on a tongue and that metallic silver, especially at night, these shoes will definitely pop. Also keep in mind that this shoe is a chunky shoe. You're gonna have the quality leathers in here and it's gonna make this shoe pretty heavy. So if you don't like chunky or heavy shoes, then that may be an issue for you. All right guys, so that's gonna be my review on this men's space mixed media sneaker by Dolce & Gabbana. Jump in that comment section. Let me know what you guys think about this shoe. Is this a crown or is this a trash of a shoe? For me, I mean, it's just my opinion. I'm gonna say this is a crown. This is definitely my style of shoe. It's loud and it's bold and that's what I like. So you guys get in that comment section. Let me know what you think about this shoe. And until then, I'll see you guys on the next video.